Mercedes-Benz has filled its range with EQ-branded electric vehicles, and the EQE SUV is the latest. It shares the platform, styling and interior with his EQE sedan, but with a high seat position that many American drivers prefer. Pricing and which one to buy? The entry-level EQE 350 Plus is believed to be the longest range model, and more mileage means less range anxiety. Both have the same performance, so its performance should be similar to that of his EQE 350-4MATIC and all-wheel drive. Mercedes equips all models with luxurious standard equipment. Even this base model is equipped with a panoramic sunroof, 19-inch wheels, interior lighting, a Dolby Atmos-tuned Burmester stereo system, and a range of driver assist features. EV motor, power, and performance. The entry-level EQE 350 Plus is equipped with a single 288 horsepower engine powering the rear axle. His EQE 350 Formatic with all-wheel drive, he adds a second motor to provide traction on the front axle, but the total output remains at 288 horsepower. The result is 60 miles per hour in 6.3 seconds for rear-wheel drive and 6.2 seconds for all-wheel drive, and both variants are said to perform equally well. Upgrading to the EQE 500 increases the combined power output of the two electric motors to 536 ponies. According to Mercedes-Benz, this is enough to accelerate his EQE 500 SUV to 100 km per hour in his 4.6 seconds. Range, Charging, and Battery Life The EQE SUV is equipped with a 90.6 kWh battery pack that is said to provide around 300 miles of range on the most efficient rear-wheel drive EQE 350 Plus model. When connected to a DC fast charging station, the battery can be charged from 10% to 80% in about 32 minutes.